Hi, everybody. We're going to wait a couple more minutes. I know it's only 3.10. We just wanted to come on and um, make sure everything was working. So, hello. So, we'll, we'll just be waiting here for you guys to all join um, until 3.15, and then we'll get started. But it's 3.10. I think it's already going. Yeah, see, look, it's going. <laughs> My husband's trying to help. <laughs> Hi, Alex. Alex is one of our artists. She helps watch and make sure that she can hear us uh, <laughs> when we're doing a live stream. So this is all relatively new for us. So if you saw the instructions before we got started, we are just, we have our, our paints out. Um, we have a downward facing camera so that you can see where Joss and I are gonna be painting. I know, there's a delay over there. <laughs> so this is, an, this is what they see, but there's like a few second delay. Um, so we have our paints in our paint palette. You can use a plate if you want to. Um, this is all washable paint that we gave you. I know, it took, uh, yeah, it took a while. <laughs> um, but then this is the only way that we can see um, everybody else in the chat. So try not to look at yourself over there because it's confusing. <laughs> um, so we're going to be painting today this, um, this uh, little heart candy machine for Valentine's Day. And um, Gung Hei Fa Choi for everyone else who is celebrating Chinese New Year. Um, we have a couple versions of it, so uh, I wanted to do a circle one, and then there's also a, um, a square one. So Joss and I did this square one a few days ago, um, and uh, he made the little crane, so it's kind of like a um, the little crane machine version, and then this is the, the candy version. Yes, you don't have to whisper, you can just ask me. You can do the square one. Here, do you can want me to put the, the square one I'll too? put the square one over here. Can you do the square one? I was going to do the circle one because that's the one I told everybody I was going to do. Okay. <laughs> but you can make what you like. So um, you remember how we did it, right? Just like make a square and then um, you can paint the bottom part with red. Yeah? Do you remember? Okay. Or you can do it like this with me if you want. <laughs> so we also have a cup of water and to like rinse your fingers in because if you want to get those pure colors that aren't mixed um, you can dip your fingers in the water and then we also have um, rags with us so you can wipe your hand on the rag and um, that way you're not mixing all the colors together on the paper. And if you um, have little ones at home that are um, anxious to get started, this is just free time. So you can have them paint whatever they want. They don't even have to paint the, um, our, uh, our little thing over here. They can paint um, whatever they like and just be creative. And, you know, any alterations you want to make, you want to make your machine blue or different colors. Um, okay, okay. You can do that too. Or pink or anything else. I was going to make all different colors of my little heart-shaped candies inside my machine, so I'll be mixing different colors to do that. Can I, make, can I not make hearts, just make dots? Yeah, you can make dots instead. You don't have to make hearts in your machine. Ooh. Yeah? <laughs> it's okay, honey. It'll be fine. He said, I don't know if it's going to be good. Oh, no. <laughs> okay, okay. I think it'll be fine. I think you're going to be fine. Yeah? Now we just wait until 3.15, and then we can get started. Okay, 3.15. <gasps> okay, Joss is right. It's 3.15. So I am going to start with um, the edges of my little candy machine. And so I have some, oh, I forgot black. I knew there was something. Oh, it's 
So if you don't have silver, you can use um, a little bit of black and white and make a gray. So I'm going to use a little bit of silver and black. We'll dip one in the silver and then one in the black. And then I'm just going to start making just kind of a round shape like this. What is gold for? Whatever you want. I just gave you all the colors that we have, Josh. And now I'll do the other side like this. Okay, so then now I'm going to rinse off my finger and wipe it on my towel. And then now I'm going to, my machine is going to be red. Oh, wow. Joss is going really fast. He's, he's moving ahead. So now I'll make a little lid for my candy machine over here. So it's sort of like a, an oblong, maybe like an eye shape, like a, you know, someone's eye. And then down here, it's sort of like a rectangle. You can make yours rounded like this. And then round, a little bit rounder like this. You need more silver. You need more silver? You can have some of mommy's. Okay. Okay, and then I'm going to fill in the bottom part of my little candy machine here. Hi, Eric. <laughs> and Nancy, I'm guessing. <laughs> and Sherry, hello. Thanks for joining us. I hope you're having fun at home. Okay, so now I'm going to wipe my finger off again. And I'm going to let this dry a little bit. And then we're going to start making our hearts. So it's really easy to make hearts. You can make them any colors you want. Um, I'll start with, I guess, yellow. So um, to make a heart, it's really easy. You just like put your finger down like this and then draw a short little line and then your other finger down and a short little line like this. And you can make smaller hearts like by not pressing as hard. There's one. Or you can make bigger hearts like this. Or you can even use um, your other finger. So here I'll use my thumb, make a big one like this. There you go. Okay. And um, if you want, if some of your candies fell out and they're, you know, out here for people to share, you can put some over here. Can on you let the it counter. dry? Yeah. Oh my goodness. Joss, you're so fast. Here, let's put yours down like this. Everyone can see it. What a beautiful candy machine. Oh, so are those gumballs? What kind of candy is it? They're not candy. Oh, it's not candy? What's in there? Prizes. Prizes? What kind of prizes? Let's see. I'm prizes gonna... and balls. Oh, okay. So I'm going to make some pink for my hearts next. So I'm going to grab some of this white from over here. Okay, can you maybe go to the bathroom and rinse off your hands, okay? What? Yeah, I see that. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so I'm going to mix up a little bit of red and some white and make some pink. And I'm going to do some pink hearts over here. So pink hearts. You can use your pinkies and make little tiny hearts like this. And then I'll do a couple hearts outside. And you can even do multicolored hearts. So let's see, I still have pink on my finger. I'm going to dip into the blue a little bit and then maybe back into the pink. And then I'll get like a swirly heart over here like this. Like that. And then, or you can mix them together and then maybe add a little bit more red. I'm going to make some purple hearts. is all about color experimentation too so you can learn about which colors you can make and fill up your candy machine did you dry it 
No, you have to wait for it to dry. But you can start, you can make your um, little, where people get the candy, the little candy door. You can use black to do that. Oh, blue, that's fun. Okay, so I think I want some light blue hearts next. So I'll get some blue, mix around over here. Do a blue heart out here. Can I have more silver, please? More silver. Here, take mine. Okay, what else? I think maybe I want some. Oh, I haven't done green hearts yet. So I rinse off my fingers and then grab a little bit of yellow, mix that around. I was making a lever. Oh, you did a really good job making that lever. That's so cool going to be easy for people to get toys from your machine. Can I use your green? Yeah, you can have some of my green. Oh, mommy, I need, I need the button. Oh, yeah. You did a good job making the button. Okay, what other color hearts should I do? Red hearts? Any color. Let's see. Well, we have a little gold. Maybe I'll make some... Oh, no. I'll make some gold hearts. Wait, I forgot to use gold. You can still use gold. So gold and silver are some of our optional colors if you want some for next time. I have another free um, finger painting scheduled in two weeks. And if you want gold or silver, it's just $3 for mm -hmm. each of these colors. They just cost more than all the other colors. So. Do you think it's... Parts, this part is dry yet? No. <laughs> so in case you're wondering at home, it's very shiny still. These dry with like a matte finish. So um, if they are still shiny, that means they are still wet and you should leave them somewhere to dry. Can you dry them with a hair with a hair dryer? Um, well, I, I can't leave here. I'm, I'm showing everybody how to finish making this. I'll just show you that, that problem that you're leaving. <laughs> well, okay. So... Um, we'll be done in eight minutes. Do you think you can wait eight minutes to dry yours? Mm -hmm. Okay, so let's see. I still have to do um, my little, finish my lid on the top. I, I have silver and black for my lid up there. So let's see. You just like kind of like a little line and then like a little nubbin on the top like this. There you go. Okay. And then down <laughs> here... Uh, I'm going to make my little door. It's 612. For my candies. Um, is it dry you yet? can use. No, honey. Is it shiny still? Not to me. <laughs> it's still wet, honey. Oh, okay. okay. And then I'm going to make my little turning mechanism black, like this. And then I'll use. Let's see, we're running out of silver. Maybe I'll have a gold turning radius or turning turning uh, handle or white. Let's see, what color should my little handle be, Dots? I don't know. How about rainbow? Rainbow? Mm. Okay, let's see. Maybe I can dip my finger in each thing. It's going to just end up blue. There. I didn't have to wait for it to dry. That's kind of like rainbow, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. I didn't have to wait you for didn't. it. You didn't. Yeah. So black, you, you don't usually have to wait for it to dry. You can paint right on top of it. So I'm going to see. What other colors hearts can I do in here? Oh, red hearts I haven't done yet. So I'm going to make some little hearts so you can see. Can I be done? You can be done. Okay. Can you say bye to everyone? Thanks for coming. Bye-bye. <laughs> This is why I schedule these for only 15 minutes because I, I know mine can't even take the whole 15. So if yours get tired and can't do any more, I understand also. <laughs> you can stay as long as you want. These are all recorded. So you can come back and via the same link, you can watch it again later. So you also have two pieces of paper. So you can always come back and paint this again or paint one of our other ones. Hopefully we'll eventually have a whole bunch so in two weeks, I'm painting little monsters. Do you want to join me again?
And uh, we're also putting, um, for anyone who wants more than just this, we have acrylic paintings on the calendar that um, last about like one to two hours. Uh, and you can, you can pause those too. And um, Ben will be teaching those. Uh, today he did um, some elephants. They're really cute. Let's see, what other color hearts do I want? Let's see, I did green. I did light blue. How about dark blue? And I would love to see all of your paintings at home. We can post them if you are interested. You can email them to me at sambruno at pinotspalette.com. Um, or you can tag us, um, Pinos Palette San Bruno, uh, on Instagram or um, Facebook, and um, everyone can see your paintings. And it's like the world's refrigerator. Let's see, so blue and what other color? Maybe like a dark green would be fun. Okay, rinse off my fingers. Get some of this yellow. Oh, I didn't do orange. Okay, let's do orange. So orange is yellow and red, and I got some of the blue in there, so these may end up be brown hearts. In case anyone didn't know, you get brown if you mix all the colors together. And red is a much deeper color than yellow. So if you want like a brighter orange, you want um, less, less red, more yellow. Let's see, I'm gonna add a little bit of white, see if I can lighten it up a little bit. my candy jar, put some out here. Oh, I like that orange. Okay, what other colors? Hmm. We have three minutes left to make other colors. Let's see. I didn't do a dark green yet. Oh, but I'm running out of yellow. Let's see. Oh, maybe we can steal some of these glasses. Oh, you can also add the the um, metallic colors to things and make cool colors. So, like one of the cool ones I found is blue and gold. So I mix that together. And make some more hearts over here. You can also use the brushes. I know some of you opted for our optional brushes that we were giving away. You don't always have to use your fingers. I just feel like it's fun to uh, touch paint. I like to touch paint. Oh, I'll do black. I like contrast. Contrast is fun. That's like bright colors and dark colors next to each other. See any other multicolored hearts you want? Let's see, maybe blue and green together. So they don't mix it up that well. And then we can go up there. Oh, I like that. It's kind of like the ocean. And then maybe I'll add a little bit of white in there. There are endless possibilities when you're mixing colors. Ooh. I'm trying not to overlap too much. I want all my hearts to be individual. Let's see. Okay. Well, I hope you had a good time with me and Joss today. And I hope you had a beautiful painting at the end. Um, you and <laughs> Joss says bye-bye. So thank you very much for joining us for our 15 minute finger painting Friday. And I hope to see you again in two weeks or for one of our longer paintings with Ben. So you can get, we'll, we have our uh, 16 by 20 canvases and paint brushes and acrylic paints um, for those of you that want something a little bit more challenging. And um, I hope you all had fun and thank you for coming and supporting the studio. We really appreciate it and tell your friends. I hope you all had a good time and that it's good enough that you'll want to share. <laughs>